So today I'm going to be showing you how I lighten my eyebrows and a few months back I lightened up my hair and I really kind of felt like my eyebrows were just a little bit too harsh and I just wanted to fade them a little bit and make them match my hair a little bit better. Um, I use the Sally Hansen Cream Hair Bleach. This is super easy to use. There are like four things in here which I'm going to show you exactly how I use them and be very careful with this though. The very first time that I lightened my eyebrows I left it on for a little bit too long and it looked like I didn't have any eyebrows. They were so light. So luckily I had a, um, a bottle of like store hair dye. So I just dyed my hair, my eyebrows back brown. Um, and they still were a little bit light, so it was okay. I just kind of left it on until I got like the desired darkness. Um, so you have to be really careful. Make sure you check it every like one minute just to make sure like when you first do it. Um, mine usually take about three minutes exactly. And I have to touch up about every, I would say three to four weeks or so. Um, I can kind of see my eyebrows starting to darken back up. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you would like to see how I lighten my eyebrows, then go ahead and keep watching. Okay, to start off with, to prep your skin for any hair bleaching, you just want to make sure that your skin is clean. You want to make sure to wait at least 24 hours after you've waxed or plucked just so you don't irritate your skin because this can be a little bit irritating on your skin. It can make it red and it can irritate it. So I like to use the Sally Hansen Cream Hair Bleach and this comes with four things. It comes with a tray, the bleach, the activator and also a little spatula. So basically what you want to do is just set down your tray and you use two parts of bleach to one part of activator. So this is the bleach. It's just kind of like a moussey consistency. You want to take your little spatula, scoop some out onto your tray. And then you just want to take about half as much as that of your activator and it's just a powder. I'm going to open it up and I just kind of sprinkle mine on. And then I'm just going to take my spatula and mix it around. It says to leave on for eight minutes but I think that's a little long. The first time I left mine on for like five minutes and my my eyebrows were really super light. So I'm just going to mix this together. So I have the product all mixed up and now I'm just taking my spatula and I'm just going to put that on my eyebrow. Just kind of smearing it around. Making sure to really get it in there. I'm going in the opposite direction that my hair is growing just to make sure the bleach gets in there really good. And then I'm just going to just go over it and place the hairs back down. What I like to do is just wipe off the brush and just get any excess off. Just kind of go around the edges. And then just take a cotton round. Just kind of wipe it up. I don't want to let it set on my skin for too long. And same thing with the other one. Make sure you just saturate your hair with it. Smoothing it back down. And then just taking off the excess. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and set my timer for three minutes and then I'm going to check it um, really quickly though. I'm just going to go over the top with a little bit more bleach just to make sure that it's covered. A 
like that. Okay, so my three minutes is up. I'm going to go ahead and check it. And I just wiped off my spatula. And I'm just going to wipe some away and check it. And it looks like it's exactly where I want it to be. I don't want it to be too light. So three minutes seems to be perfect for me. So I'm just going to scrape off the bleach. And if, if you still need it to be a little bit lighter, you can just use whatever you have left over on your tray and then just do it again for a couple more minutes until you get your desired lightness. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and I will be right back. So this is the final result. As you can see, there's not a huge difference, but there is enough of a difference to notice that it just looks a little bit less harsh than having like a super dark eyebrow. So this is it after I've got my makeup on and my eyebrows filled in lighter. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.